A century old home saved from demolition after a tree collapsed on the roof earlier this week. District 1 Councilman Roberto Trevino says that he received several concerns about the home. The 19th Stephen Cavasso spoke to the councilman who shares how the home was saved and why he hopes to see more preservation in the future. The best uh, housing infrastructure is the existing housing infrastructure, so we want to protect that. District 1 Councilman Roberto Trevino says some of the oldest houses in San Antonio lie within his district. But one of those homes was left with major damage after a massive tree collapsed on top of it Wednesday morning. The home located off Wick Street in the historic King William District was at risk for demolition. The city might come out and, and, and uh, declare that, that the building's unsafe. But Trevino breathing a sigh of relief after a city engineer report revealed the home was salvageable. He adds a city goal is to preserve, not to demolish. We as a city are doing everything we can to be proactive, not reactive to these kinds of issues. And that includes making sure San Antonio residents are made aware of city programs. The city's got resources. It's thinking about uh, very important infrastructure, uh, whether it's large trees or housing. Trevino says an arborist with the city can always take a look at trees to make sure they're safe. People can also get their damaged roofs repaired under the San Antonio Under One Roof program. That a home is, it, it really keeps people safe and and protected from from the elements. Now we're standing outside that home and you can see behind me where that tree is still laying on top of the roof. Now Trevino adds that the tree needs to come down before any damage inside can be assessed further. Now we're told that weather did not cause that tree to collapse. Rather, it was the size and age of the tree, which we're told is over 100 years old. Steve.